Question three says, here is a tile. The tile has turned. One of the diagrams below shows the tile after it has been turned. Tick the correct diagram. Now all of these tiles look quite similar, but indeed only one of them is the same as this tile after it's been turned. Now what we could do is we could get some tracing paper. So that's one option. We could actually trace this shape here and then check each of the five shapes by rotating the shape we've traced and seeing which one it fits over. And if you did that, you would eventually get the right answer. However, we could do this without tracing paper just by looking carefully at the shapes. Well, these two shapes, first of all, this half circle and this quarter circle are on opposite sides. So any of the shapes, any of the rectangles where the shapes are on the same sides are not going to work. Because when you rotate this around, the two pieces of the circles are still going to be on opposite sides. So this shape, both bits of the circle are on the same side. So that one can't work. And also this rectangle, both bits of the circle are on the same side again. So that one can't work. The other thing, the other clue we've got is that this quarter circle here is in the corner of the shape. Now, when you rotate it, it's still going to be in the corner. So if it's not in the corner, it can't work. So this quarter circle here isn't in the corner. So this would rule, this clue would rule out this rectangle. And this quarter circle here is not in the corner either it's moved up from the corner so that one can't work either so we've actually only got one possible option left so by process of elimination it's got to be this one here this is the one we need to tick but as i said if you wanted to do a check you could just trace the rectangle rotate it round and you would find that it is this middle rectangle that is the correct one.